Hey, it's Woody, and welcome to another installment of Woody's Extras, and today, the topic is guilty pleasures. Now, guilty pleasures are things that, well, I'll just define it, even though you probably already know, things that people do, but they don't really tell people about. In other words, things like, for instance, if you like Barry Manilow, well, I'm sure you're not out there telling all, I'm not going to tell my friends that I enjoy the Copacabana. <laughs> However, Honey Boo Boo has been taking the world by storm, this Honey Boo Boo show. Have you seen Honey Boo Boo? The show is just crazy, it's and I think oh. I think it's like a train wreck. Everybody watches Honey Boo Boo Child. Which is the biggest problem, is well, that everybody watches it. Well, we watch it because problem. we don't know what's going to happen next. They were eating roadkill. Roadkill. She named the roadkill as they were slicing it up. I saw that episode. Their spaghetti is... Uh, Sketty? It's ketchup. Yeah, yeah, it's ketchup, ketchup and butter. butter. And butter. I mean, Jesus! You know what we call that in my house? Well, SpaghettiOs. But that's... <laughs> I read where they're now looking to get a raise. Now, the TLC network has Who's a bona fide hit. Well, the, the Honey Boo Boo family. Oh, my God. <laughs> they have, you have to admit, TLC has a bona fide hit with Here Comes Honey Boo Boo. Now, I found it amazing that they were only getting paid $2,000 an episode. That's at two grand an episode. Well, now, they were happy with that, too, until they, <laughs> they realized that, hey, we could get more money. So now they're asking for up to $8,000 an episode. Uh, now, again, this is uh, under the guilty pleasure. But, Zip, I want to know, what is one of your guilty pleasures? All right. Brother, I'll start. Okay. I'll start. Okay, yeah. Honey Boo Boo, which, okay, it's out there. Well, one that I've talked about before, I, I do enjoy Jersey Shore. And, you know, this is the final oh, season wow. of MTV's Jersey Shore. I can't look away. I, I try, but I don't know what those crazy kids are going to do next. God, I mean, I'm afraid yeah, I would have missed something. Guilty but pleasure. you got to um, have a guilty pleasure. Okay, I've got a good one. Sometimes when I'm alone. John Hall, please ring 130. Sometimes when I'm alone, I listen to Michael Jackson. Michael Jackson? Uh, I listen well, to Michael which, which if, if anybody knows me, kind of goes... Totally against my character. Well, yeah, but so let me ask you: that, Do you wear a glove when you watch? I Michael wear Jackson? a hat. A hat. And I also have some spangly socks. <laughs> that I wear with black shoes, so. <laughs> You've got some RG three socks going on. But anyway, guilty pleasures. We all have them, whether it be Honey Boo Boo or. <laughs> Jersey Shore, Michael Jackson, that's, you know what's bad, is now I feel like, I, I don't feel like that was guilty enough pleasure. I feel like. Because <laughs> that's something you do yeah, all the time. Yeah, right? well, yeah, I enjoyed the Michael Jackson. What? I didn't well, know I should have been a Jackson shit. 5. Correct. I'm talking like bad. No, I like I'm that. I'm talking like, really? But then again, well, you got to understand, I was, you know, that's back when I was in my teenage years. I enjoyed that. Yeah. Well, you're old. Thanks, Zip. <laughs> I'm old and I've got some really bad guilty pleasures. 